Hi, this is Happy Bird from happybirdscraftinghaven.com and I'm here today to show you a very simple project that I believe even the kids could do. I purchased these um, sew-on buttons at Michael's and as you can see there's um, two holes, one at the top, one at the bottom and I found these in the scrapbooking sticker section where all of the um, stickers and embellishments are. This was at the bottom shelf below the um, recollections embellishments and it was originally six dollars for a um, hundred and eight pieces but I used my 40% off coupon so I got it for a lot less and what I decided to do was to um, use my jump rings to make earrings and I thought this would be so nice for the kids to be able to make the female relatives in their family um, a nice set of earrings and if you wanted to you could also make um, bracelets simply by connecting jump rings to the sew on buttons and it would be very easy to do you know to make beautiful little bracelets um, but I'm going to go ahead and show you how to make these earrings I purchased these um, silver plated earrings from a wonderful Etsy seller by the name of Sandy and her shop is called Your Day and um, I'll go ahead and, and share that information again although I, I, I did share this information in my last video but I'll still post um, a link to her site in this video down below in the drop down bar and these were $6.99 and she sent them in a really nice little snap case so um, go ahead and check out her shop okay so go ahead, let's go ahead and get started now I used took these together I used the 5 millimeter jump ring. So I'm going to take a few of those out here. And um, actually, a couple. <laughs> That's all I need. Anyway, um, I determined what colors I wanted to use. And so I'm going to go ahead and pull out the same ones. You can use, I mean, to finish this set, but you can use. Um, any combination of colors and I'll show you another section here that um, hold on for a moment okay yeah, I'm going to show you another section here I think the colors would go nicely together something like like this like that. Green and purple. Or if you wanted to, you could make the focal color green with a touch of purple. Okay. Those all kinds of different combinations that you can make and they have them in the blue, the um, kind of like a teal color, the silver, green, I call this purple but it's it's more like a fuchsia and um, then this is kind of like a, what you would call a black diamond shade. Whoops. There we go. Okay. Now let's get started. And the first thing I'm going to do is open the jump ring. I run my finger along the top so I can see um, or I can feel where it splits open. Okay. And you're just going to slide this on like this. Wait a 
like so. And then slide the silver button there and then close it shut. And then you're going to take another jump ring. I'm going to set this down for just a second. You're going to open this. And like I said, I run my finger along here to kind of find where it opens and shuts because a lot of times I can't see. I can feel it. here and I'm going to hook the last whoops <laughs> I used the smaller jump ring as a 5 millimeter you could use the 6 millimeter if you'd like but I just thought this would look nicer. Okay, so now we have all three hooked together, and I used the um, graduating type um, style earring. So it's smaller, smaller, larger. So, but you can do it any way you'd like. And then I took a ear wire, bent it like this to the side. I just slipped it on like so, closed it back up. And these are very lightweight, by the way. And now we have a beautiful pair of button earrings. And uh, I hope you give them a try. Thank you for watching my video. God bless you all. Bye bye.